Opening statements have been made by both the prosecution and the defense at the Donald Trump hush money trial in New York. The prosecution argues that Trump is attempting to cover up a scandal constitute election fraud, but the former U.S. president says the trial is the Democrats' way of putting the brakes on his election campaigning. Ian Zin reports. On Monday, the prosecution and Donald Trump's defense made their opening statements at the former president's hush money trial, the first criminal trial of a former U.S. president. The final jurors were seated on Friday, and all eyes will be on New York Supreme Court Judge Juan Merchant as he oversees the first criminal trial of a former U.S. president. Trump has pleaded not guilty to all 34 charges of falsifying business records related to an accusation that a payment of 130,000 U.S. dollars was made to porn star Stormy Daniels in return for keeping quiet about an alleged encounter between Daniels and Trump. For opening statements, prosecutor Matthew Colangelo argued election fraud, saying that Donald Trump had a scheme to corrupt the 2016 election by silencing people who were about to come forward with embarrassing stories that may hurt his campaign. The prosecution argued that it wasn't political spin or a communication strategy to avoid bad press, but that it was a planned and highly coordinated scheme of illegal hush money expenditures. Meanwhile, opening statements from Trump's defense attacked the case as baseless, saying the former president did nothing illegal, arguing that Trump was trying to protect his family, reputation and name brand. While leaving the courtroom on Monday, Trump downplayed the trial, calling it a very minor bookkeeping case and that it was indeed about an election, not the 2016 election, but the one this November, saying that it was a Democratic attempt to disrupt his chances at reclaiming the presidency. And over here, I did nothing wrong also. This is a Biden witch hunt to keep me off the campaign trail. So far, it's not working because my poll numbers are higher than they've ever been because the public understands that it's a witch hunt. Thank you very much. The first witness for the prosecutors was former National Enquirer publisher David Pecker, also a longtime friend of Trump's. He took the witness stand before court broke for the day, and his testimony is expected to continue on Tuesday. Ian Zin, Arirang News.